Monty Rice was one of the most productive linebackers in the NFL last year on a per snap basis. He had a run stop rate of 12.1%, which ranked third among qualifying linebackers. And he had the seventh lowest missed tackle rate at just under 5%. As a run defender, he's quick to diagnose the play and he does a good job working through traffic. He has great short area burst and he moves at full speed in pursuit, but he's a really consistent tackler with the stopping power to finish tackles through the ball carrier. So for most linebackers, the ability to shed blocks is a non-negotiable, but the Titans have been able to get by with smaller linebackers who aren't as effective at the point of attack. But if you look at a player like David Long, for example, he started off as someone who was kind of being protected by the scheme, but he developed into one of the better block shedders in the NFL. By his fourth year, he had so many moves that he could execute at a high level that he was pretty much unblockable, and that's what took his run defense from good to great. And if Monty Rice can improve his consistency engaging with blocks and add a couple more moves, moves to his tool belt, I think you'll see a similar transformation.